What's wrong? Mommy, I'm scared. Why are you scared, honey? I'm scared Amari's gonna drop me off this bridge again. I don't know what she's talking about. That was so weird. How'd she know? I know that song. My grandma used to sing to me before she died. How do you know that song? Grandma taught it to me. But grandma passed away five years before you were born. Hey, honey, can you tell me what name you got above your head? Princess. Stop messing around. I'm serious. What does it say? No, I'm not. It says princess. Whatever. I'll just ask you when you get older. Hey, princess, where's your friend? Haha, <laughs> very funny. We all know you're lying. Why would I lie about something like this? It really says princess. Yeah, in your dreams. Let's go, guys. Are they bullying you because of the princess thing? Wait, you don't believe me either? I want to, but the real princess is at the palace right now. I don't even know anymore. Hey, mom. Hey, honey, can you turn on the TV for me? Yeah, sure. Should I order some food? The palace has released a statement about the dethroning of the princess. The queen has found out she's not her real daughter. I'm not going to embarrass him today. Great. I'm so going to get a detention for this. Amara, why aren't you wearing the school uniform? Because my soulmate chose for me to wear this. You know when the teacher sees you, she's going to give you a detention, right? Yeah, I know. Amara, come here. Yes, miss? You're not wearing a school uniform. Why? Because my soulmate chose for me to wear this. Is that your excuse, your soulmate? Look, if you're going to give me a detention, just do it already. Just because you said that, you're getting a two-hour detention. Payback time. You really think I'm going to wear a bikini to school? Not happening. <laughs> your soulmate really made you wear a wedding dress to school. Yeah, he's horrible. Wait. Why am I feeling kind of sick? I can't wait to see how far he is. Same. You ready? Sick. Mine's only 25 miles away. Mine's 5 miles away. Lucky. You're going to find yours before me. Honey, hurry up. You're almost late for school. Yeah, I was thinking, um, do you wouldn't mind if I didn't go to school today? I really need to find my soulmate. Very funny. It was worth a try. Any luck finding your soulmate? No, my mom didn't let me skip school to go find him. Well, I found mine. It's John. Wait, the popular guy? Yeah. Amara, the teacher said to give you the snow. Wait, where are you going? My dad forgot his laptop at home, so I need to go to his work to give it to him. Where does he work? At a prison. What? That's crazy. I know. Thanks for the laptop. Sorry to take you out. No, it's fine. But how? Hey, I really like your hairstyle today. Thanks, Amara. You know what? You've been really nice recently. I'm liking it. Thank you. How did your words change? Well, I guess it's because I changed as well. No way. This can't be. You're always mean and a bully to everyone. The words aren't appearing anymore, so maybe you're the mean bully. What? Why did the word appear? I'm not a bully. Words don't lie. But don't worry. Maybe if you're nicer to people, one day they'll change. Who doesn't want a new phone? Amara, you got a package. Coming. Amara, right? Yeah, that's me. This is for you. Can you sign over here? Sure. I didn't even order anything. Oh, it's the phone. How can I forget? How did you know I was smiling? Hey, can I have some water? I forgot to bring my water bottle this morning. Yeah, sure. Amara, no phones in class. Sorry. How does he know everything I'm doing? Mom, I don't want to go to school today. What? I said I don't want to go to school today. Funny, now pack your stuff. You're almost late. Amara, why are you late? Why do you think I'm late? I came here on purpose because I don't want to be here. Detention! Why can't I lie? What do you mean? Every time someone asks me something, I automatically say the truth. You're lying. I'm not. Ask me something. What do you think of me? You're a two-faced, fake little... Excuse me? Do you really mean that? Yes, every single word. What's happening? A girl in our class got murdered and they're trying to figure out who did it. Oh, it was me. I killed her. Wait, what? Hey, where are you guys going? Shopping. Can I come? Of course not. Have you seen your bank account? I need to get a job. 
Hey, what can I get for you? Can I have a large pizza and some chicken wings? Sure, that'll be 20 pounds. Here you go. Amara, I need to talk to you real quick. What's up? I'm firing you. Firing me for what? Did I do something wrong? No, I'm firing you because you're too broke. That doesn't make any sense. I'm working to not be broke. Isn't that the whole point of getting a job? I don't care. Pack your stuff and leave now. Hey, honey, how was work? I got fired because I'm too broke. You got fired? Get out of my what? house. Are you seriously kicking me out? Yes, leave now. Hey, I have an appointment at 2.30. Come on in. How can I help you? I need money. Okay, do you have any past things that might get you a lot? I got fired from my job for being too broke. This loss is going to get you a lot of money. Let's begin. I'm so tired of being single. Dad, can I go to an all-boys school? An all-boys school? I mean, yeah, that's what you really want. I already chose it. I'm so excited. Anyways, I'll see you later. I need to go to my new school. Wait, before you go, you must know that boys only school. It doesn't matter. I already chose it. Bye. Wait, it's important. I can't wait to get to school. Everyone's definitely going to be surprised because I'm the only girl there. And I can finally get myself a new boyfriend. Guys, look. Why is there a girl wearing our school uniform? For God's sake, Dave. It's still morning. Don't worry about it. But really, wow. She's so beautiful. Why does the toilet smell like pee? Because there's no girls here, so we can pee freely. Wait, what? Are you for real? No, I'm just joking. Can I have your number? I I'm just gonna go. Today we're gonna learn how to cook, so you can be the dream husband in the future. Yes, cooking class. This is one of my favourite classes in school. But why do all guys look so pale? Please choose your own group. One group consists of two people. We're gonna learn how to cook, so you can be the dream husband in the future. Yes, cooking class. This is one of my favourite classes in school. But why do all guys look so pale? Please choose your own group. One group consists of two people. Why are you all looking at me like that? Please be in my group. I can't cook. Leave her alone. She's going to pick me. Don't listen to them. Come. The seat next to me is free. Whoa. Relax. Instead of fighting over me, I can just teach you all how to cook. It's very easy. Why is there a girl in this class? Who allowed her in the school? Throw her out now. Why should we throw her out? She's better at teaching us how to cook than you are. Just get rid of her now. Ugh, I hate teenage girls. Are you sure you want to kick me out of the school? That would be a very bad idea. And why do you say that? Because I... Are you sure you want to kick me out of the school? That would be a very bad idea. And why do you say that? Because I chose to be in an all-boys school. I'm sure if you kick me out, you'll get in trouble. You chose? What do you mean by that? Yeah, it was one of my options. That's weird. Usually people don't get to pick. Well, anyway, I think you're lying, so I'm going to have to report you to the principal. But miss, I don't think that's necessary. Yes, it is. For now, I'm sending you home until the principal makes a decision. But miss, don't send her home. We need her here. Be quiet. Pack your stuff. You're leaving. Hey, Dad. You're home early. How was your first day at school? I got sent home. What? Why? Because apparently I'm not allowed to be in an all-boys school because I'm a girl. Well, I tried telling you, but you didn't listen. Boys schools usually don't accept girls, so I don't even know how you go as an option. Well, maybe I go as an option because they need me there. I was able to help them today, so maybe I'll be a good addition to the school. True. Well, what's going to happen now? The principal will make a decision whether I get to stay or switch school by tomorrow. Anyway, I'm going to go to my room. I have to study. Okay, good luck, honey. The principal wants to see you. Okay. You wanted to see me, sir? Yes, I'm very surprised to see a girl in the school. How did you get here? Well, one of my options was to go to an all-boys school. I'm really sorry, but I don't think we can keep you here. It wouldn't be appropriate, as you're the only girl here. Plus, all our students here have top grades. I don't think any girls can beat their grades because, you know, boys are smart. Wait, really? Is that the reason you don't want to keep me here? Yes, the only way would be to test you and see if you get good scores on the exam. In order to be a student here, you have to get 100 out of 100. So, do you think you can do it? Okay, I'll do it. Shortly, I'll prepare your exam paper. Don't be upset if you can't do it. Oh, I can, trust me. I'm going to prove to you that girls can be smart too. We're not just here to look pretty. Hey, can I ask you something? Yes. Did you have to do an exam before starting in the school? Yes. And did you have to get 100 out of 100? What? No, I only had to get 50 out of 100. So the principal did this on purpose because he thinks I can't get a good score. All right, thank you. I'm going to prove him wrong. <sighs> I'm so ready for this exam. I've been studying all night. Here's your exam. You have one hour. I'll be standing here to make sure you don't cheat. Oh, don't worry, sir. I don't need to cheat. This is going to be very easy for me. Here's your exam. You have one hour. I'll be standing here to make sure you don't cheat. Oh, don't worry, sir. I don't need to cheat. This is going to be very easy for me. 
You have two minutes left. Done. Are you sure you don't want to read over your answer? I already did. When do I know the result? In about two hours. Okay. Can I go to class now? Go ahead. I'll call you when the results are in. Psst. Hey, Amara, how's your exam? It was okay. Can you imagine the principal wants me to get 100 out of 100 in order to stay in the school? What? That's insane. It's also impossible to get 100 out of 100. No one ever knows the answer to everything. Well, I was up all night studying yesterday, so I hope I got all the questions right. Hey, stop talking and focus on the lesson. Sorry, miss. Amara, the principal wants to see you about your results. Okay. Come on in. I'm pretty surprised with your score. I'm not going to lie. I didn't think you could do it. Because usually girls aren't smart. What does that mean? You broke the school record with the highest grade. <laughs> so, does that mean I'm a student here now? Nope, not yet. What do you mean? That was the deal. I have to test you at PE. As you know, boys are usually better at sports. And if you want to be a student here, you can't embarrass us. We often compete against other schools. And what sport do you want me to play? Basketball. Considering your height, I'm not sure you can do it. It's not too late to quit and switch schools. No, know? I want to do it. Okay, practice starts at 5 p.m. today. Don't be late. Okay, sir. Okay, everyone. I want you to try and score as many goals as you can. Why can't I get any in? Hey, let me help you. What's your name? Chris, and you? Amara. Okay, focus on what I'm doing. Since you're a beginner, you have to stay not far away from the goal. Focus on the little box right there. Once you hit it, just like this, the ball should go straight through. Hey, you have a try. See, I knew you could do it. Hey, Chris, get back to your team. Don't help her. I have to go. I'll see you later. But hey, don't give up. You're doing good. Amara, come here. Yes, sir? I want you to score 20 goals without any misses. If you can't do it, you can't be a student. 20 goals without missing? Not even once? Not even once. Okay, get ready. The test starts in 3, 2, 1. A simple house or a luxury house? Who wants to live in a simple house? Of course I'm going to choose a luxury house. Wow, this house looks like a palace. Honey, what have you done? How come our house looks so luxurious? I got the option to choose between a luxury house and a simple house. And I chose the luxury house, mom. Whoa, this way I don't have to be ashamed anymore if any of our neighbors decide to come visit. Do you guys want to come mines after school? Of course, your house is so luxurious. I wonder what Amara's house looks like. I've seen it. It's really disgusting. Hey, what are you guys talking about? Why are you talking to us? What did I do wrong? You are wrong because you're not rich. Let's go, Jenny. What? This year, our class sleepover is going to be at Jenny's house again, okay? I don't mind sleeping at hers. Her house is beautiful, unlike Amara's house. Guys, don't you want to come to my house? I'm having a birthday party there. In your smelly house? <laughs> it sucks. I don't want to come. I don't want to come either. It's dirty. But my house is not as old as you think. Don't lie. I've seen you go to your house after school. It looks really dirty. Enough. All right, Amara, I'll give you a chance. Everyone's going to your birthday party, but if your house is what everyone's saying it is, the sleepover will be at Jenny's house. Okay, sir, I understand. They'll soon know the truth, but I have to get ready before they come. I wonder what the reaction will be like. Oh my god, that must be them. I can't wait to see Jenny's reaction. Hello, guys. Whoa, is this really your house, Amara? Yes, sir. This is my house. I can't believe it, sir. I saw her once go home after school, but it wasn't to this house. Amara, is this really your house or are you lying to her? Of course not, sir. This is my house. Why would I be lying? I don't believe her. She doesn't want to admit that this house isn't hers. This house is too beautiful to be Amara's. Okay, I'll give you 24 hours to prove that this house is really yours. And if you can't prove it, the sleepover will be at Jenny's house again. Okay, sir. What happened, honey? My classmates and my teacher think that I'm lying about this house being mine. But why didn't you prove to them that the house is yours? How can I do that? You can show them the contract of this house, but the contract is still with your dad and he's overseas. So I have to wait for him to come back? My teacher only gave me 24 hours to prove it, mom. Your dad's coming home tonight. Don't worry. All right, mom. I'm going for a walk. I'm so angry. Of course that house isn't Amara's, but she won't admit it. But if it's true that the house is hers, the sleepover will be there every year and not at your house anymore. Of course not. She's lying. I've seen her house. It's not the one we went to today. My dad's not home yet. Honey, I'm home. Dad, finally. Do you have the contract for the house? Yeah, your mom told me you needed it, right? Here you go. Thank you so much, Dad. This is going to solve all my problems. It's almost been 24 hours and Amara still hasn't proven that the house is hers. See, sir, I told you she was lying. If she doesn't prove it quickly, the sleepover will be at yours and she'll get kicked out of school for lying. I'm sure the house isn't hers. 
I have to show them. Sorry I'm late, sir. Did you bring what I asked for? Jenny, why did she come to school? I thought she wouldn't come because she doesn't have proof. Yes, sir, I brought it. Here you go. Good. Now, let's see if the house is really yours. Oh my god, so that luxurious house is really yours, Amara? That house is really Amara's? Yes, see, sir, I wasn't lying about the house being mine. Jenny, are you ready to leave school? Amara wasn't lying. I'm sorry, sir. Please don't kick me out of the school and keep the sleepover at my house. Because my house is still more luxurious than Amara's. Jenny, the sleepover was at your house last year. Your house is really luxurious, but Amara's is even more. But that was last year, sir. My house has changed. It's more luxurious now. Okay, students, let's go to Jenny's later to see the current state of our house. Okay, sir. Sir, can I go too? Of course, Amara. All students in class can go. I'm sorry, sir, but I don't want Amara to come to my house. What? Why not? You went to my house too, and I didn't care about it, even though you called me a liar. It's my house, and when I say no, it means no. Why doesn't Jenny want me to go to her house? What does she have against me? I feel sorry for you, Amara. Even though I'm friends with Jenny, I'm sorry. You don't have to feel sorry, Olivia. You know what? Just come with me to Jenny's house. If she says anything, I'll take the blame. Okay. Hey, Jenny. Hey, Olivia. <gasps> Wait, why did you bring Amara here? Oh, come on, just let her in. You feel sorry for her, don't you? Do you want to get removed from our friend group? No, Jenny, but... Hey, what's that noise? Can you guys stop fighting? Amara, come on in. Whoa, your house has changed a lot. Yes, sir, I hope you like it so that the sleepover can continue to be here. Okay, I've made my decision. This year's class sleepover will be at... Uh... Good morning, honey. Morning, mum. Huh? 200%? Why is this percentage thing above my head? Oh, that's the level of love someone feels for you. Wow, so your love for me is 200%? That's right, honey. <sighs> hey, Amara. Hey. Let's walk to class together. 10%? This whole time you said you love me like a sister. Turns out you were just lying. What? What are you talking about? There's no point pretending anymore. You're just fake. I thought she was my best friend. I can't believe she was pretending this whole time. Hey, babe. Hey. Are you okay? Yeah, your love level for me is at 100%, right? Yeah, of course it is. If you don't like me, why are you dating me? We're over. Mom, home. My daughter's so stupid, you can easily lie to her. What did you lie about? I told her it was a love percentage, but it's actually a hate percentage. My daughter's so dumb, you can easily lie to her. What did you lie about? I told her it was a love percentage, but it's actually a hate percentage. Mom! Honey, what are you doing here? I thought you were at You school. lied to me. Now because of you, I've lost all my friends at school and I broke up with my boyfriend. Oh, honey, I'm so sorry. No, no, you're not. Why do you hate me so much? Because you're a spoiled little brat. What kind of a mother hates her own child? I'm not your real mom. What? Your dad cheated on me and your real mom wasn't ready to raise you. So your dad left you here with me. He's always traveling for work and I've had to raise you all on my own. Is that why you hate me? I hate you because I haven't been able to live my life how I was supposed to. I lost my job because I had to take care of you. Well, I'm sorry I was such a headache to you. Hey. What do you want? I'm sorry for what I said yesterday. You called me fake. I know, but it was all a misunderstanding. Will you forgive me? Vote for a safe world or a dangerous world? I vote for a safe world, of course. Why didn't it? It doesn't work like that. Everyone gets to vote and the one with the most votes gets picked. You have to convince everyone to vote for a safe world. Because if this world ends, it's all your fault. Why my fault? Because it's all in your hands. Okay, this should be easy. Surely everyone wants to live, right? No one really wants this world to end. Okay, positive thinking. You can do this. Jake, you have lots of girlfriends, right? Please help me. Help you with what? Tell them to vote for a safe world. I only need a hundred people to vote. Okay, fine. I'll help you. Okay, hurry up, go. I didn't mean now. I have basketball. <gasps> Can't back. you just cancel? This is really important. All right, fine. I'll cancel. Yay. Thank you. Hey, Emma, will you tell everyone to vote for a safe world? Why should I help you? She's my friend. Hey, Jake. Okay, if she's your friend, I'll vote for a safe world now. Tell your friends too. Yes, of course. Girls, vote for a safe world. Thank you so much. Ew, don't touch me. I'm only doing this for Jake. Jake, thank you so much. Because of you, I've got 50 votes in already. Why aren't you saying anything? I've helped you enough. I really need to get to basketball practice. Bye. Wait, can I join you at basketball practice? I can just ask all your friends to vote for a safe world. There's going to be lots of people there, right? Okay, just hurry up. 
Guys, please help me vote for a safe world so we can all live. I'll only vote if you become my girlfriend. Okay, uh, vote first, then I'll answer. It don't work like that. Answer first, then I'll vote. Vote for a safe world, otherwise I'll get you kicked out of this basketball team. Uh, yes, Captain, I'll vote for a safe world now. That's it, we've all voted for a safe world. Thank you, guys. Um, I'll treat you with some water bottles. Hey, um, can I please have 50 water bottles? Yes, of course. Wait, why is there only 99 people who voted? I swear there was like more than 100 people who voted. Here's your drinks. I put them in a box so it's easier to carry. Thank you. Oh yeah, miss, can you please help me vote for a safe world? Yes, of course. Thank you. Wait, how come the number didn't change? It's stuck at 99%. Is everything okay? Yes, miss, everything's fine. Thanks for the water, I'll pay you later, bye. Hey Jake, I'm curious, you also voted for a safe world, right? Oh yeah, that's right. He helped me get a lot of people vote for a safe world, but he never voted himself. Jake, please help me vote for a safe world. I only need one more person to vote. I can't, Amara. Can't? Why? It's because I... Because I'm not from this world. Huh? Not from this world? Then where are you from? I'm from space. <laughs> You're joking, right? No, I'm being serious. Why isn't anyone saying anything? We're all shocked like you, Amara. We're not going to believe you, Jake, until you show us your spaceship. Spaceship? Why is everyone digging with their shovels? Because we're helping Jake hide his spaceship. <sighs> Jake, say something! Do you still want to be friends with me, even though I'm not from this world? Yes, of course I do. I don't care where you're from. Okay, if so, come with me. I want to show you my spaceship. Here it is. Huh? This is your spaceship? But it's so small. How do you even fit in there? Oh, there's plenty of space. Trust me. Hey, you guys. You're high school kids, aren't you? What are you doing in school at this time? That's the school security. We need to hurry up and cover your spaceship. Yes, please help me. Thank you guys so much for the help. Hey, Jake, can I ask you something? Yeah. Why did you come to this world, since, you know, you're not from here? Because there's nothing in my world. I like it here more. And I never expected to make any friends, but now I feel like I belong oh, here. Oh, cool. Mom, there's already 100 people who voted for a safe world, but why is it stuck on 99%? That's because the last 1% has to be voted by someone who's not from this world. But why? Because the votes are very important. Okay, Mom, I'll be right back. I know exactly what to do. Hey Jake, my mum said the last 1% had to be voted by someone who's not from this world, so can you vote please? Amara, I told you, I really can't. <sighs> Why not? If you don't vote, I don't want to be friends with you anymore. Uh, okay, okay, I'll vote for a safe world. <sighs> See? Easy. It's not about it being easy. If I vote for your world, my world will be destroyed forever. Wait, really? Yeah, this is all your fault. I'm just joking, look at your face. <laughs> Don't worry, this whole time, no matter what people voted for, both of our worlds will still be safe. As long as no one voted for the dangerous world, of course. People will disappear every time you sneeze or blink. I hate people, so blink. That way they can disappear quicker. Let's see how many people are left. 10,000? Whoa, looks like there's a lot of people living in the small town. I have to get rid of them quick. That way, I can have this whole town for myself. Honey, what are you doing? I'm trying to get rid of everyone as quick as I can, Mom. What? So you're the one who got that option? Yeah, why are you shocked? Don't tell anyone, and please be careful. <sighs> don't worry, Mom. I'm going to make sure you don't disappear. You can't control who disappears because it happens randomly. What? Hey, bestie. Hey, um, can I just ask, how many times does a person blink per day? 20,000 times. That means everyone's going to disappear today. Why are you No, asking? um, it's nothing. Okay, anyway, what I was going to tell you was... Wait, did she just disappear? Be careful. I had the person responsible for everyone's disappearances in the school. How do you know that? It doesn't matter. You have to help us catch that person so we don't disappear. We don't have much time. Okay, class. I'm sure you all heard about the rumor. Sir... But, um, what if it's fake? It's not fake. We all have to work together to find whoever's responsible for this. Yes, we have to kill them. How are you going to find them? It's easy. We're just going to have to test everyone. Whenever someone blinks and another person disappears, that means it's them. Okay, it's your turn, Amara. Please blink. Why aren't you blinking? I'm going to get caught. I have to blink fast so that everyone disappears before they kill me. I feel so lonely. Now I have to live alone, eat alone, and sleep alone. It's so boring. 
Wait, there's still some people left? Yes, I have to find them. <coughs> I just heard something. I think it's coming from that house. Okay, I can't blink anymore, otherwise I'll stay on this earth alone forever. Finally, Amara's here. How do you know my name? Finally, Amara's here. How do you know my name? I want to thank you because you eliminated everyone. What do you mean? Now, the world can be mine. Your power doesn't work on me, it's useless. What? All I wanted was to live alone and be independent. I didn't want to mess up the world like this. Oh yeah, there's still three people left. Me, that guy, and I still need to find one more person. Hello, is anyone there? This is useless. I'm never going to find them. What do you mean? Isn't it just me and you left? Who are you looking for? Um, no one. I'm just bored. Okay, you're going to be my assistant for when I rule the world. Assistant? This guy is crazy. Yes, do you have a problem with that? No, not at all. At least my house is still here. I can't believe I made my mom disappear. Wait, she left a note. With an address? Maybe it's a clue. Okay, I'm here at the address. Hello. Yes, I found you. Can you please help me save the world? We can't fight that guy. He's too powerful, but I can help you bring everyone back to this world. Wait, how are you doing that? Why did the numbers get stuck? It's because you blinked, so they disappeared again. Okay, I have to stop blinking from now on. Turns out there's still some people left. What are you doing? Now the world will be mine. Are you going to kill me too? No, I'm not. You're valuable. What am I going to do now? There's one more thing you can try. Try blink three times, he should disappear. <gasps> it worked! So, what now? You have to sleep. That way I can bring everyone back to this world. Okay, in that case, I'm going to sleep now. Please be at least one. I've never gotten any wishes before. Uh, what is that? Mom, what does this mean? Oh, I didn't expect you to be to stay awake for 24 hours that's easy honey remember the rules right never fall asleep until the time is up that's correct otherwise i don't know what can happen to you i don't understand why we can't sleep did you forget what happened to david right you all have a time that you should not sleep under any circumstance what happens if we do sir it's different for everyone some disappears some get sick and some even dies in their sleep Mom, I slept 40 minutes only. At least you'll survive. I just got three days. Take this, honey. I made you coffee. I hope it helps. I can't believe it. I have to go three days without sleep. Oliver got 10 days. But this is impossible. Rebecca fell asleep yesterday and her skin peeled. It's horrible. Honey, how long did they give you? They gave me 10 hours. Okay, hurry up and go sleep while you still can. Oh my gosh, no, that's impossible. Don't scare me, what happened? A month without sleep. Mom, that's 720 hours. Honey, that's impossible. Please open page 306. 
Hey, are you okay? More or less. I haven't slept in four days. Today we will learn a new topic. <sighs> Don't sleep. Don't sleep. Amara, you're falling asleep. I guessed it. Of course I'm never going to be anyone special. Hey, what are you guys doing? Sorry, but from now, we can't be friends again. Yeah, we don't want to be friends with you. Why not? Because you're an ordinary person. I'm the child of a company owner. We're not on the same level. And I'm a mafia kid. Class, today we'll be doing history. Please make sure only special students are in this class. But sir, where do ordinary people go? You need to go to the ordinary people class. Oh, look who we have here. I knew you'd end up working as a waitress. Can I take you guys' order? Amara, there's someone who wants to order tea. Please deliver it to table Why A. Why not you? Because he said he wanted you to deliver Me? it. Me? Yes, hurry up. Here's your tea, sir. Thank you. At the request of the prince, I'm here to invite you to the palace. Why me? Because the prince said you're his childhood friend and he wants to meet you. What? Wait, why is my status loading? How long can I move today? Infinity? That means I can move forever. But I won't tell anyone I got infinity. I don't want to be arrogant. Mom, I'm ready for school. What's your move time? I only got five minutes today, so I can't drive you to school. I got two hours. Okay, make sure you hide so nothing bad happens to you. Yes, I know, Mom. I still have 30 minutes to move. I have an hour. How much time do you have, Amara? I have five minutes. Then we can't be friends anymore because we're not going to be in the same class. Not in the same class? What do you mean? Sir, is it true that those with little time has to be put in another class? Yes, the important thing is to be safe. That's why we put you all in the same class. So that nothing bad happens when your time is up. Okay, guys, you have 30 seconds left before your time ends. I have to pretend now. Looks like time is up. Take them to the doll shop to sell them. Okay, sir. Wait, what? Honey, what you can never look at is loading now. Oh, but what if I look just a little bit? This is serious. What appeared? Something round. Like this. The moon. So you must never look at it until you turn 18. Klaus, I need to make a list of things you can't look at. I can't look at cats. I can't look at my mom. I can't look at the sun. I can't look at the moon. My grandma has it and it's easy. Amara, I'm scared to death of this. <sighs> I agree. I don't understand why we can't look. But on second thought, did you see that Henry can't look at his own mother? This is scary. Mom, I'm home. How many times have I told you to be home straight after school? You're late and the moon's already rising. Can you just stop? Up until now, I still don't understand the meaning of this whole thing. Honey, just wait a little longer. The rules disappear when you're 18. It shouldn't be long. I couldn't look at water. It's time to go sleep. <sighs> yes, Mom, I'm just going to listen to the news. Teens are disappearing as they have decided to break the rules and look at things that they shouldn't. Good morning. Have you seen